This is the Mobula 7, which is a very popular little tiny quadcopter, very stable, very agile. It runs on either one or two cells, and these are the high voltage lithium polymer cells. If you have one of these, you probably already know that, but this is just for the new viewers. The point of view here from making this a little bit better, I mean, these are the things that I have done to this particular Mobula 7, in my view, that can enhance the um, not so much the performance although these modifications that I did do not add very much weight I mean a, a very very little weight but I'm talking about a little better protection here for the uh, things that get scuffed up and that get, may get damaged in the process of flying these little guys a little bit hard Let me start with the, the bottom section here. The first thing I did to this uh, Mobula 7 is install two wire wraps here to secure these wires for the motors. Now these motors, uh, these wires are uh, silicone wires and you have to be careful not to over tighten these tie wraps here around the wires and around these bridges that form part of this um, uh, reinforcement between these uh, circular ducts. So those are held in place just that's snug enough you know to hold the wires in place and keep them from dragging on the ground or getting uh, caught in a uh, twig or something if you're flying over grass or tree even now the next thing I did was uh, to install these little legs these are the suspension and this is just to provide some spring suspension to the landing to pre prevent also from um, uh, doing damage so on the, the other hardening. modification that I did is to tie wrap this uh, connectors here you can see that there's a tire wrap there and it's kind of also loosely or rather snugly but not overly tight that is holding the little wires the black and white wires on this bridge here between these two ducts you can also see that I've added uh, heat shrink tubing to the two connectors and that's just to keep them from uh, flopping and uh, keep them from bending too too much the other section that I reinforce is right here with this uh, tie wrap and it's just grabbing the blue wire that forms this uh, series uh, connection between the two connectors and that's held at the bridge part of the canopy the other modification that I did is I put this flexible tubing here and I just simply inserted my antenna right there and I made a bent right into that socket that's part of the canopy and that also protects the antenna from bending in case this lands upside down. So these are the modifications that I did to my Mobula 7 and uh, it's been working excellent. If you do the same I hope it helps you also and I hope you enjoy the flights even better.